Bonk cryptocurrency price prediction. We are going to be talking about this right here on this channel. And could this crypto be the next bonk plus some other meme coin gems you guys should be paying attention to in the crypto market today? And we also have some secret millionaire meme coin tips at the end of the video. So if you guys want to make the most amount of money trading meme coins in the crypto market, make sure to stick around to the end of the video. As always, not financial advice. And let's get straight into this video. So the first thing I want to do is a bit of an update on the bonk price so we have seen a bit of a retracement in the last week or so for bonk it has had an absolutely phenomenal run in the crypto space you guys can see the 14 day window for bonk absolutely insane volume coming in for its all-time high which got up to around this level which was extremely high four zeros three two and the volume on bonk literally went in excess of billions of dollars right there so 1.6 billion uh nearly two billion dollars for bonk so absolutely huge amounts of of capital coming in for this cryptocurrency why is the market going crazy for bonk why has this one exploded it did get the double binance and coinbase listing for this cryptocurrency and the other thing to understand about bonk the cryptocurrency is it is you know the number one meme coin on solana and there's a lot of excitement about solana in the crypto market uh people are thinking solana as potentially you know a very strong competitor towards ethereum if you have a look at ethereum's market cap 265 billion solana's got a market cap of 31 billion and uh, people are saying you know over time, you know, Solana might catch up to it. So it's going to take a lot of work. But at the same time, what's going to happen is the high risk assets such as Bonk, they're going to go flying as uh, some of these layer one chains get more and more recognition in the crypto market. And currently the fully diluted market cap of Bonk is sitting nearly around 2 billion circulating market caps around 1.2 billion. And does the Bonk price still have potential to go up? If you have a look at Dogecoin, you have a look right here. You know, Dogecoin still got that big market cap of 13 billion. So potentially there is still a lot of move uh, room for Bonk to continue to move up. And who knows, this one could add more and more utility to the cryptocurrency in the future. And it definitely could be another one to watch out for in the crypto market. Other meme coins that have been making moves that we have been speaking about super early on the channel. Guys, check out the price graph of Snack right now. So this one is looking super bullish right here. So it was dormant for a long period of time. And Snack is actually a bit of a uh, sleeper on the crypto market. So if you actually scroll all the way back to June, Snack was around. We knew about Snack back here. You can see it did actually retrace when it first came onto the crypto market. According to this crypto exchange right here, which is Mexi, it did have a long period of flatlining. So sometimes in cryptos, you know, cryptos do go to sleep. So, so Snack was having a little bit of a sleep under a tree. And then he decided to wake up and uh, go straight to the moon right here. And you you can see the uh, movements for Snack over the last few days and a uh, few weeks right here. So looking absolutely crazy strong in terms of price action. And if we actually do look at the price gains for Snack since around, you know, the beginning of December, roughly, you are looking at around 548% gains in this cryptocurrency. And this is all real money. But the question on everyone's mind is where, what happens with Snack next? Do we have catalysts that could potentially continue upwards momentum for this cryptocurrency let's talk about it so if you actually have a look right here the snack price trading at two zeros and a two one right there it's up 25 percent in the last 24 hours so guys absolutely explosive gains getting made pretty much a 2x since we've uh, been chatting about it a bit on this channel so you guys are making some super fast money right here watching this crypto channel and uh, if you have a look again 14 day window looking very very strong so what could potentially be some catalyst for snack to push it further to the upside so have a look at the fully diluted market cap of this one 161 million the other thing i did tell you guys that is uh, interesting about snack is uh because the market cap is not properly you know posted to coin gecko it's actually a hidden meme coin so if you actually have a look right here the market cap doesn't actually populate and sometimes this hides the meme coin amongst the rising other cryptos in the crypto market so if you have a look right here coin gecko meme coin section which is a good place to look out for meme coins in my opinion because you can spot some uh, trends early right here but again snack is uh, nowhere to be found and the reason is because that market cap dynamic figure it's actually missing right here other things to potentially watch out for for snack the cryptocurrency is it does have a very strong community over on twitter so let's just pay attention to some of this i actually put out a poll yesterday we had nearly 
35,000 views, 3,000 votes for this. And Snek came in, clear winner, 61% right here. And this is testament to the powerful community of Snek, the cryptocurrency. So you have to remember in all these meme coins, there are going to be people who are part of a community and communities generate value. And also particularly over on X and Twitter, communities help spread the awareness of a crypto project for free as well. So completely organic marketing organic growth snack having a very powerful crypto community and we also know cardano has a very powerful community as well as a layer one cryptocurrency so snack right there strong community to watch out for but also on top of that you have to be aware it hasn't actually been listed on major crypto exchanges out there in the crypto market so you can see it is listed on Mexi. So I've got a link to Mexi in the description of this video. You guys can get some nice bonuses on Mexi. Use my link in the description of this video. And it's also listed on Bing X, which I've also got links, uh, bonus links to as well. Check it out right there. So Snack is trading on some medium crypto exchanges, but it's not on the big ones like Binance. It's not on the big ones like Coinbase as well. You have to be thinking about big crypto exchanges as potential catalysts. And the other thing you have to be thinking about for Snack is, uh, you know, the layer one question is, well so when you look at these cryptos you have to think about the future potential of cardano is cardano going to be a huge winner in the crypto market in 2024 do you think it has potential because what might happen is snack might catch a bit of a rocket ride if cardano moons in 2024 so watch out for that question for that meme coin as well and uh, the good, the other good thing as well, the market cap for this, relatively speaking, is lower than some of the other big ones out there. So if you compare it to like SHIB, you compare it to Pepe, you compare it to Doge, you know, SNEC is actually a tiny fraction of some of these. So again, Doge has a market cap of like 13 billion. SNEC is sitting at around 161 million. So this is actually a nice market cap, in my opinion, for the quality of meme coin that it is. Another crypto that I want to talk about that could potentially be a next bonk and it has been making crazy moves is that cocking you. So guys, we spoke about this one yesterday, up 126% in 24 hours. So this is moving super fast. So 163 million fully diluted market cap. And it's got the meme of the rooster, the, the name. And when you say it, it, it sounds a bit non-PG uh, friendly. Uh, but you guys can see right here, this one has also had explosive gains uh, in the last 24 hours. We have a look at the seven day. Let's push it out to 14 day actually. Again, very, very, very nice uh, run for this cryptocurrency. You can see the volume picking up uh, for cock in you right here. And uh, it has also hit recent all time high. So again, another massive winning meme coin we've had right here on the channel. If we have a look right here at bullish factors for cock, as you can see, it actually isn't listed on too many crypto exchanges, which means you have to put in the hard work for this crypto. So you're going to have to learn how to use Trader Joe. We're going to talk about this as a tip at the end of the video as well. But very important to understand, it's not actually listed on any centralized exchange yet. And that can actually be a very bullish factor for cryptos because lots of people don't know how to use DEXs and cryptocurrency. So right there, the price graph of cock is looking good and again the narrative for this one is it the number one meme coin on the avax chain okay so that is looking exciting watch out for these chains watch out for strong meme coins that are coming out on these chains right here but that price graph is looking explosive other shout outs as well so i want to say vault has a very strong twitter community over on twitter it has retraced i do like the market cap of this one and if this one gets some more exciting maybe things on the roadmap other things to watch out for for this crypto watch out for vault as a bit of a sleeper fully diluted market cap pretty low 33 million but could it be a big one to explode in the future other cryptos to also pay attention to what is pepe doing so pepe you know going a little bit sideways in this market right now ranked at number 108 and it does have a big market cap so around 548 million for pepe you know we found this one at 30 million but it also has been as high as 1.5 billion in, in the crypto market as well so it has been a big cryptocurrency in the past but having said that who knows the 2000 24 crypto run might be absolutely huge so watch out for pepe as well in the crypto market and right now it's a bit of a mixed day in the cryptocurrency field so if we actually jump over here the other thing you have to be paying attention to is uh you know bitcoin is going up some of the altcoins today are a little bit flat so bitcoin outperforming some of the crypto market but we have to be watching out for 2024 if we do potentially get big bitcoin etfs big institutional money and maybe in the usa they're going to pump the economy for the election year 2024 watch Watch out for that because the stock market might go up, the crypto market might go up as they start to cut potential interest rates. So when they cut the interest rates, everyone feels richer, 
lots of artificial money are getting pumped up even though i feel that inflation hasn't really been tamed right here but that is a big macro factor to watch out for and guys let's talk about this question about some meme coin tips that can help you become a millionaire in the crypto market so what are some good tips to know let's get tip number one out of the way first because i want to remind you guys high reward high risk market so one of the big things you can do in the crypto market especially meme coins understand the whole meme coin market it's going to be high reward high risk which means one of the most defensive moves you can make right out of the gates to preserve your capital that you're investing into the crypto market is limit the amount of investment so some of these cryptos you know you invest like a hundred dollars it turns into millions of dollars if you pick the right one but you want to limit your downside in these cryptos so in the worst case scenario some of them do go to zero uh, you know you lose whatever it is you put in so it's not these are not types of cryptos you want to be putting your life savings into because they are so risky but also at the same time if the right one goes off you can potentially retire in the crypto market another very important thing to understand in these meme coins is uh they trend at different times what you can do is prepare yourself uh for when 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 and where these opportunities come up in the crypto market so what do i mean by this so at the moment if you're paying attention to these meme coins you are seeing them pop up on different chains uh initially they might be popping up on different dexes as well so you at the moment if you haven't prepared for this you should take time to do this and this doesn't even cost you any money it just costs you time and you're gonna have to do a little bit of research here so if you do not know how to use dexes already you should be looking into this so if you have a look right here we go to we go to dex screener right here we have a look at these chains on the left you got ethereum and if we actually have a look up the top it's going to have uniswap pancake swap sushi swap other types of dexes if you go to solana you can see orca you can see radium if you go to the binance smart chain you can see pancake swap if, if we go to arbitrum you can see uniswap if we go to avax right here you can see trader joe up the top and uh, the list basically goes on base optimism plus many more so what you're going to be seeing in the crypto market is a lot of these meme coins they're going to be coming up on different chains so right now in the market you know millionaire tip is you need to be prepared right now for the next trend so if you see like the next pepe and you know this one is going to go from one million dollars to a hundred million dollars you don't want to be in a position where you don't know how to trade for example on the binance smart chain or you don't know how to trade on a dex on ethereum because that is going to cost you time time you don't have in these types of meme coins so again you want to be getting in super early because most of the gains in these types of cryptos guys they're made on dexes before they actually go to centralized exchanges so the most amount of profits you can make is actually getting onto them as if they do launch onto a dex first in some rare examples cryptos may launch onto like you know tier one crypto exchanges if they're very good projects uh, but they tend they those ones tend to be very well funded so we're talking about multiple million dollar pre-sales and things like that but in the meantime you should be uh, learning how to use all your dexes on different types of chains getting set up right there so avalanche binance smart chain ethereum getting set up on metamask or any of those types of native wallets so you're in the best position when they do come up the other thing you should be paying attention to or you should have this already set up is multiple crypto exchanges ready to go and i'm not talking about binance i'm not talking about coinbase because again if you're buying it when it hits binance and when it's hitting coinbase you guys it's all the gains a lot of the gains have already been made in the crypto so you want to be uh on some of these other periphery exchanges that do tend to list a lot of these high risk cryptos a few good examples of this is uh, definitely have a MEXC account. So if you don't have a MEXC account, I just recommend getting one anyway, because a lot of these cryptos might list onto crypto exchanges like MEXC. I've got bonuses to MEXC in the description of this video. Use my link, get some free bonuses uh, based off trading volume. But it's good to be in a position where, you know, if it does go to MEXC very early, you can potentially grab it on MEXC. For example, if you have a look at SNEC right now, it's trading on MEXC. It's also trading on BingX right there. So MEXC is a good one. BingX is another one. So I've got a big bonus to BingX if you want to uh, jump into this one. But you just want to have a crypto account ready to go in case a very hot crypto gets listed on one of these ones first. And generally what happens in crypto is a lot of these cryptos these meme coins they will go to these periphery exchanges before they go to the big ones like coinbase like binance like kraken if they do go to kraken they're going to go to these periphery ones and you just want to be uh, in early but you also want to be prepared and you don't want to be the lazy coinbase trader so if you're only trading on coinbase again you're going to be missing out on tons and tons of potential money that uh, could make you a millionaire in the future and again you want to be taking positions in a lot of these meme coins before they go to Binance and Coinbase so once the Binance and Coinbase listing happens you know 
immediately once that announcement happens potentially the gains will be priced in so you can see right here on the bonk chart you know at some stage you got the double listing of coinbase and binance and uh, you can see the pump right here and then it actually retraced after it went to uh, binance and coinbase so you can see people taking profits making money in these cryptos and actually cashing out some profits right here but you want to be a person who is literally buying in before the coinbase and binance listing somewhere along this line right here and Tip number four is uh, to take your risk capital out and take sequential profits if you want to play the long game in crypto. So that's what I do. I have multiple lures in the fishing pond, but I also am a person who takes risk capital out. So very early in crypto, say if a crypto does like a 3x or a 2x very early, I'll take out the initial investment I put into the crypto, but I also have the remaining crypto for when it does sequentially increase in price. So again, in a lot of these cryptos because you don't know if they're going to do 100x or 50x or 20x but one of the best things you can do is just take profits you know as they go up to some degree so take a bit of profits take your risk capital out and that's way and that way you can ride multiple cryptos so one thing a lot of people do is they just hold for too long without taking any profits along this kind of lineup and uh you never know in crypto you know what the longevity of mini crypto projects are so if you actually have a look not even here but if you go to coin gecko and if we were actually to have a historical look at this actually we'll do it on coin market cap right here because it gives you a bit more of a historical snapshot and uh it's based off my tweet right here and you can see the tweet i put out crypto evolve survive and compete for the gains and uh the truth is in crypto some pre some projects over the long term don't actually make it they fall off and uh sometimes they might actually end up in a crypto graveyard believe it or not they might become extinct but uh if they can maintain competitive and maintain their position in crypto it's going to be very good good but if you actually have a look right here if we bring up this historical snapshot 2015 in the crypto market if you're investing right here you can see you know the price of bitcoin obviously very low but have a look at the top 100 cryptos and you might notice that some of these cryptos don't aren't in the top 100 anymore so peercoin is that one in the top 100 is next in the top 100 is namecoin in the top 100 is made safe coin in the top 100 new shares gridcoin bytecoin Rubicoin, Counterparty, uh, Blackcoin, Monacoin, uh, because some of these cryptos, for example, if we jump into Monacoin right now, you can see on this price graph, it went up all the way to nearly, it went up to $15 for this crypto, but it actually didn't recover over the long term, after, over multiple years right here. Not saying that Monacoin won't moon again, but I'm just saying you definitely want to be taking some profits as these explosive gains get made. So even if this crypto, say, didn't do 100x, you definitely want to be taking some profits along this journey right here and that's what can happen in crypto so it is a hyper competitive market and if you are new to crypto you know crypto projects will rise and fall and the more risky a crypto project is the harder it's going to be for it to uh you know survive in the long term in crypto but you just have to have that mindset why am i in the crypto market am i here to make money what am i going to do with that money you know once i make it you know and taking profits is a very smart thing in the crypto space because again it's hyper competitive projects rise and fall all the time but guys that is some millionaire tips for playing the long game in crypto but guys i really hope you got value out of this video go have a good one and i hope your cryptos dominate the crypto market and you make lots and lots of gains but appreciate you guys tuning in go have a good one see you guys in the next one crypto zeus signing out